Alrighty, this is Bryce at Allen Music again. We're going to do a little quick look at the Earthquaker Devices Bit Commander. So for a rig today, we're just using a clean Boss Katana and a uh, 335. So here we go with our clean tone. This is everything bypassed. Here we go. <laughs> Okay, we got a little bit of noise in the guitar, something in the electrical system. Okay, all right, so I'm going to start with all of these down, and we're just going to bring in the level and the bass tone. So that is just your straight guitar tone. It kind of puts a little fuzz to it, it kind of makes it nasty. <laughs> Love that okay so we'll go one by one we'll go with the subtone next this is only the subtone nice and crazy here's the uh, one octave down So this is like a futuristic nostalgic pedal for me because it makes sounds I've never heard but it also reminds me of Parliament Funkadelic and stuff like that. Okay, here's the uptone. So this almost sounds like an octave from a fuzz. Just nice and crazy. So now we have this filter control. So I'm going to turn this back up and I'm going to put the filter down. And um, it kind of just makes it really dark. Okay. So um, let's start. Let's add in the up with the bass tone. <laughs> So it kind of gives you the octave sound of like Jimi Hendrix, you know. So I love that. Um, and then this, you know, you bring this down octave in with some of your guitar and you kind of get an octaver, but it's got a fuzz and it sounds all weird. <laughs> sub just sounds like an old Moog or something that's like got some issues. Awesome sounding. So with this down you can almost kind of get like a sub old bass tone type thing. So let's turn them all on. Let's get all of the sounds. So that's our quick look at the 
Earthquaker Devices Bit Commander. Hope you enjoyed it. Come on down to Allen Music at any time. Any of us will be happy to help you and happy to show you the Earthquaker Devices Bit Commander. Thanks so much.